the person that I think is gonna win this year is Beyonce and the reasons why I think that is because I feel like a lot of people generally like her songs a lot and also as well as I think her songs are pretty good. And yeah. I think the album that's gonna win is Sabrina Carpenter's new album because it's super popular. Everyone kind of knows like at least three songs from it and it's like all over the radio. Um, I think Ariana Grande's um, album Eternal Sunshine is going to win because she's really iconic and she have not written a new album for a really long time and she's really good with um, I would pick Eternal Sunshine by Ariana Grande because I feel like she's like been popular and everyone like she's a known artist from ever since like 2016 so I feel like she's just a popular artist among all people and yeah um, I say short and sweet um, because it was it's a really popular like um, album and like a, a lot of people are using her song and stuff like that on TikTok and like especially her like her filter and stuff so I think Bebo Dobie will win for album of the year because honestly she has grown like as a big uh, in popularity and since her recent breakup and her friend with her ex-friend I feel like it caused a lot of controversy and I really think she deserves that Grammy so she can prove them wrong. Um, I think the album that's going to win album of the year is um, Short and Sweet by Sabrina Carpenter because it's just an all around hit. Yeah, the revolution, y'all, y'all, y'all. Yeah. Yep, yeah, the revolution. The revolution, y'all.